Hello everyone, Geriatric here, and the reason for this nice festive hat is we are almost a week out before Christmas. Uh, I actually had another hat that I was going to wear, but uh, this one from Randy Orton it just came out of nowhere. Gary's back, who's been trying to bribe me with drinks and everything. Oh, Gary, when we when are done with this video, we'll have a little chat about your little part in the rebirth of Paintivity Universe. So, all right, so this game is called Sweater OK. Now, this is like those uh, games where you're the snake and you have to get all the food, except with a twist. You are now the food, and you have to get away from the snakes. So it looks very interesting. It's very, as I said, it looks like a sweater. Kind of intrigued me. And so uh, let's give it a go. Okay. I am the screen thing. I don't know where the snakes are. But I see a star food or something there. I get that. Oh, yes, I got that. She even put hers as my own. Paintivity. I was number one for a while. She puts it there. Alright, so. It was pretty straightforward. I don't know where the snakes are. Unless those things are snakes. Can I attack you guys or something? Or. Nope, oh, you guys must be the snakes. And I'm the guy getting all this stuff. Oh, a little confused on this game. Color's changing though. It does really look like we're playing on the back of somebody's sweater. This is crazy. I am the little green guy if you're having a little trouble figuring out who I am. I don't know if I need to like... Uh oh. Uh, I was just eating. Uh, okay. Let's try this again. Replay. Okay. Alright, that's why I'm, I'm, I'm still the green guy. So I gotta find all this food for these snakes, bro. I mean, I don't think I'm a button because those guys are buttons, but... See, there's a little button right there. Can we do something to you? Okay. Alright, uh, we are going strong here. But yeah, I like, uh, if you remember the old Silver games, I got it. I remember playing that on my... You know, old phone tonight, the Nokia, and that was the only game you could play. Alright, there we go. We are playing against real people here, which is kind of cool. Okay, are you something? Oh, yes. Well, now we're going down, now we're going this way. Oh god, oh god. Here we're coming for me, here we're coming. Those snakes, they're button snakes. Well, every time they eat something, they eat, they become bigger. That's what's going on. And with me stopping them, uh oh. They can't get to those. Okay, get that one. Oh, whoa, this is bad country. Ugh. Ugh, poor guy. The new. Okay, sound scores. I don't know what scores right now. Yeah, paint activity. She's even on there. Two minutes. Alright, we're playing again. God, this is kind of a relaxing game. It was funny because when I was trying to find games to play for this one shot, the only thing I could really find was a lot of almost like Super Mario clones. And I'm like, I don't want to do that. I mean, these one shots are supposed to be different than the series we're playing. And if you didn't know that, we are playing Super Mario Brother, Super Mario Builder, doing the 100 Mario Challenge right now. We're on normal. We'll see where it goes from there. Okay. Good. Do you not like that? Can you eat me? I'm a little concerned here. Oh. God, if somebody was high in playing this, this changing background would be pretty nuts. Wait, can I get you? Okay, so they can attack me. Alright. Very simple game. 
I remember, you know, game people used to say it's easy to learn, but to put down. All right. See, now you disappeared. Oh, I wonder if it's one of those big. If you're, if they're bigger than me, then they can't do anything to me. If they're bigger than me, they can eat me. What? Well, right. What's down there? Yeah, come here. Follow me, right this way. I want to see what this blue guy is down here. It's almost like Pac-Man. Pac-Man on ropes or something. Maybe I'm trying to stop these things from growing. Okay, that didn't do a damn thing. Gary, I don't need your advice. Just trying to help. Yeah, you helped uh, quite a bit. Help somebody. Let me try to move. Well, let's see what this does. Clock. Clock. Makes me. Oh, makes me faster. Weak. <laughs> I'm like boop, boop, boop. I'm like destroying everything now. Yeah, where's creativity now? Come on. See, I wonder if they're playing against me. Like, are they also... There I am, I'm number 44. Looking good. Of course it says paintivity, because that's just the way my life goes. Right now. Hey. Hey, boy. Right here. Oh, so long. Oh, you want that? Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, these games are sometimes really good uh, stress relievers and stuff like that, because... You know, you can just kind of relax. There's really nothing really at stake. And you just play, play. Oh, that says death. Oh, and this is a good run, too. I want to know. Alright, I'll tell you what. I will just leave that here until one of them are getting close. If one of them seems to be going for it, then I'll go for it. Heading for a beeline for right here. Alright, uh, let's see what happens. Oh, I killed them all. Yes, that's that's for me. Right there. Bam. Bam. No more will snakes for undetermined reasons eat. Us poor helpful fruits and blobs and things like that. Oh, they're growing and I'm like stopping them. Uh oh. I was about to say he's too big. Oh, fun. Okay, we're getting the hang of it. Here we go again. All the levels are gen randomly generated. Sweater, okay. I mean, I think it's a play on uh, Slither IO or EO. You know that game? It's kind of a free game where there's a snake and just kind of running around. But it's interesting. The background is very interesting with it, like, literally looking like wool patterns on a sweater. Of course, this lady's got animals and all sorts of things on her sweater. She might want to think about, I don't know, maybe some laundry. Are you too big? Nope. Gotcha. Nope. Nope. I'm sorry. Nope. <clears throat> no things for you. And the snakes are buttons on things. That's cool, too. I don't know if I can. I probably could, but... Uh-oh, I like that. Come on, give me that. Uh, there's that. Boop, 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 bam. Speed run. Oh, so close. Huh. That was kind of a dick. Mm. That one's getting big. Huh. Come on, come on. Saw that track coming. And Gryffindor. Oh, it's time for another speed run. I hope I'm doing something right. I don't seem to be getting points. And I don't know if my whole goal is to kill. Hello. Die. Kill these guys or just stop them from being born. Ooh, Saint Man's hot though. I know you can turn the temperature down, Gary, but you know what? Don't bother yourself. We've had a lot of duties this past week. Working double shifts. 
you know, working behind my back. You know, one can... Uh, you might be too big. You're too big. I'm always like it. <sighs> Let me play this game with like one hand. I'm just using one hand. Oh, get that there. It's kind of weird. I'm kind of... Uh-oh. 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 Oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh, well... I think that's enough for this one. Oh look, they turned into little bears. Name, yeah. Oh, gone twelve oh five minutes. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this uh, episode here. This is sweater. Okay, it's a fun game if you really just want to get into a game. And as I said, it, the art style is very impressive. It's um, that's really cool with the whole sweater thing. Um. But yeah, give it a try. Um, it's on sale right now. It's less than a buck if you go to Steam. And uh, yeah, I think it's fun. So uh, this is Geriatric. And Gary. Hoping you're having a fantastic holiday season. And always remember to keep it retro. This also reminds me of a game called uh, PT or Trailer. That was for Silent Hills, may it rest in peace, but it was like this where you just had to keep going through everything. Let's melt things. Okay, got another piece. It doesn't seem to work anymore. Okay. I hope this is right, because I kind of screwed this up.